I like teaching. No question about that. It was both rewarding and a challenge. There was never a dull moment with an all-male class. All in all, my students were a good bunch of guys. Oh yeah, they got out of hand once in a while. But boys will be boys. Two of my students gave me moments I'll never forget. First there was Rick, a rebel. You know, tough cocky type. Then one day, I sensed something fierce burning inside him. I could see it in his eyes. I was determined to find out just what it was. Okay, I will give you an essay on these gentlemen here, so I want you to study up as much as possible, okay? Because this will have a bearing effect on your final term, okay? Don't sound like it's too much. Okay, JD, hey, you got something to share with the rest of the class, sir? No, no, not important. Oh, come on, man. Yeah, yeah, man, come on. Okay, fine. That's enough. Okay, I want you to study pages 615 to 689 for tomorrow's assignment, okay? And you're going to be quizzed on it. We don't have too much time left here, so I want you to leave yesterday's essays on the table here. And Rick wants to see you after class. your grades haven't been up to snuff here. I mean, like, have you been doing too much partying or, like, you know, not studying at all or what? No, man, I, uh, I, I do my assignments, you know, and I really study everything. But... Well, the reason I'm keeping you after class is I'm letting you decide what you want to do. If you want to get through this year or if you want to go along for the ride. Okay, I'm giving you time to think about that and decide. Well, no, um... Well, hey, I'm going to make sure you think about it now. Dear Mr. Ramsey, you once told me that if I needed any extra help to let you know. Well, I need it now. I'd like to come by your house at 6 o'clock tonight. Brian. Yeah, I guess I never had any complaints. Mm -hmm. 